Hi everyone, I'm back. Now, I've just printed off these. I'm going to be doing... Uh, I don't know what I'm going to be. Like a plaque or something. I'm not sure. So, I just need to cut these ready. It is done on canvas. I don't need that much of it. And I want it vintage looking. So, I'm just going to cut these up. Now, when I cut a um, print from canvas, see the bits like this bit? The bit I cut off. Because it's canvas, I never waste it because you can stamp on it. So I just put it to one side. I know a lot of people will waste quite a bit. Not in this house. Well, I'm just cutting this section here. That can be used and printed. It all can. Which I might do when I'm doing my... Um, artwork, whatever it is I'm going to do. No idea at the moment. But anyway, regardless, we've got plenty here to play around with. I might make like a mini book or something. See, I'm not sure. So, that's that lot ready for the next project. But, in the meantime, pop that there. I've got this huge bag of pearls. It just arrived this morning. Oh, and the doll's heads. I'm just waiting for the bodies to come in. And these dolls, is the same fairy that I use for my doll. And the bodies will be here shortly. I don't know why they've sent them separately. I haven't got a clue. But they will all be here shortly. And then you can... Uh... I'm not sure, Peggy, if you wanted a doll. I think he did. I can't remember, love. I do that much in the week. I can't remember. So I'm just going to move all of this so I know what I'm up to. And where the mat. I can go there. Might need those. Now... Like I say, it's second-hand jewellery. It arrived this morning. And obviously, it's uh, broken. But I can alter this. And these are glass pearls, of course. I'm going to end up with lots of different sizes and this uh, various colours and whatnot. But... What I'm interested in is see like the clasp. So I need to just take those off there. And there's a beautiful clasp. Don't need that. And I just need to get that off if I can. So let me just see. I can just get that bit off and you can usually waff it back and forth and it will eventually come off oops there like that see and then that I can use that as a centerpiece somewhere and it is a genuine vintage one and there's nothing missing on it so that's something I've gained from that and then I've also gained like from the beads from the necklace itself. Now, um, I don't generally clean them because I, uh, so if the vintage, the vintage, just use them. If you know what I mean. I just take them all apart. I haven't got the strength I used to have. <laughs> I haven't. Right. Let's 
take them all apart and then we can... Uh, what I'm going to do with them is I'm going to be bagging them up. So like I said, you'll get a mixture. They'll be modern and, and uh, vintage. These are definitely vintage. You can tell the old vintage ones. Well, they're way more for a kick-off. <sighs> like that. So, now let's have a look. Now that can still be used. That can hang off a, like a charm or something. See? Put the pieces outside of there and then... Sorry, I'm going to have to take my candy off. Right, like I say. Oh, ah. You do end up with a really good selection of pearls. All right, cleaner will get it. I can see it where I am. <laughs> There we go. I mean, I've dealt in pearls now for years. Now, let's see. I mean, I will go through them. Make sure that the ones we sell are decent. See, some like that, I just throw out. Now, that's not a pearl. It's just a beaded string. Then mixture between plain glass and beaded, and it was a genuine um, mixed pearl necklace between glass and pearl. Some of them are quite oily um, as well. Right, now obviously if there's any good clasps on them, we keep them, but for any newbies, um, do you know, I've just been doing this and not even looking to see if you can see, I'm not sure if you can, let me just bring this forward a little bit, yeah, what I'm going to do just to pull a fair bit of this out, Like that. These are the uh, ten millimeter ones. Now watch out for these bags. They will be sold uh, mixed bag per mixed pearl bags. We do these a lot. See, now that's, the, I mean, I could sell that as is, but I'm not going to. And you actually gain other things, like those. Connectors, which can be used for other things. Let's have a look. Here's a purpley one, or grey one. 
coffee. We just whisk them off. The clasp is no good, so we get rid of it. Here's a purpley one. Now, if you sometimes get them like this with knots in, uh, and you have to pull them through, that one will need time spent on it. So I will put that to one side to do that after. Let's have a look, see what we've got. I'm trying to find the, see like this with a connector on. These are nice pearls. But you can use that for a pair of earrings now. See? Use it for earrings, to make yourself a pair of earrings. That on a earring thing. You make some danglers. So that's what I do with them. I don't want to keep them as necklaces. I have no need for that. Now that is what I, what I was saying the other day. This is the sort of thing we keep like that and you can hang that from a charm or something. Make your own charms. So we keep them separate and they go in a separate pot. There we go, I'm just going to cut this off. And there's another one. So I've got a matching pair now. Oh, we found that one. Well, the clasp isn't any good, but what, well, it is in a way. Because what I can do with this, I'm going to show you this. Now, for miniature people, that looks like a little miniature book, doesn't it? So we can put that as a miniature book. So again, never waste. I've only done about four necklaces, five necklaces. I'm getting loads. It's another decent clasp. Again, if I don't want to use it as is, I can use it like a, a book. I can put a little diamante in there and there. That's not a problem. And then we can make it look like it's a miniature book. So, I'm just going to cut all of these. And I use a lot of small pearls for fillers and, and whatnot. Now I'm going to do some handmade things to sell in the shop, like the bling sensors and that that I do, because I've got I'm getting a really too much of a collection. I mean I'm always crafting, so I've always got something on the go. But look, that can look like a little book, another book. I will clean it up obviously before I'd use it. Like that. We can trim that off. And you stand it on a shelf, lay it down on a shelf. There's so much you can do with them. See, okay. Right. Thank <laughs> you. 
Oh, what's this? There you go. And I don't need that bit. But again, look, lots and lots of pills. Right, now, I can chop this. Wait a minute, let me just show you this. I know you think I'm crazy. Well, maybe I am. But I save money whenever I can. And I can look at what I'm doing and say, I did that. Right. So you see that? That's what went into the clasp. But what does it remind you of? I'll do it that way. What does it remind you of? Well, I can cut that end off, attach a piece of wood across there, and make it a meat chopper for a miniature one. Um, uh, or a chopper for a chopping board. I didn't have to buy one then. Bit of a skewer. Look, let me just show you. Oh, someone's going, what do you mean? <laughs> I'll show you. Right, we've taken that bit off. Let me get my knife. Okay, taking a skewer. Split it. Just hang on. I'm just going to see if I can do it with this. I mean, something really simple. <sighs> Hang on, because I'm filming. I can't, I mean, I would do it. I wouldn't do it with this glue normally. Take that, and I've got straight away. I mean, I do it a lot, neat, so I'm just rushing this. A meat chopper, an axe. There's just so much you can do. <laughs> but there you go. I might have to use a different tool on it. I will get that out because I know it can come out. But there you go. So that's another thing that can go on. Now that again can look like a book. You know. You could, I mean, even with doing that as a book, you just add a few pages to it and a little back plate, make it into a nice book. And there's another book, or you can use it in the middle of a flower. Anything you want, whatever you want. But I think that's it, you get the gist of it. I mean, those have already got loops on them. You know, we've got like little loops on, so they'll hang anywhere. But we don't bother, we just mix them in. Right, like I say, that's how you do it. I hope that's helpful. We've tons there, and I shall bag them all up. <laughs> Thanks for watching, take care, and uh, speak to you all soon. Bye-bye for now.